Contamination is the killer of mushrooms and it can be 100% avoided with a few extra steps. Now, if you're not already using Petri dishes and agar, um, then you're probably going wrong somewhere because the only way to check whether your spore syringe or liquid culture is 100% clean is to whack it on a plate and let it grow and see if that plate grows nice, lovely, white, fluffy mycelium or whether it grows some nasty, dank, horrible, uh, nastiness that shouldn't be in there and you don't want that in your substrate or in your grain uh, uh, uh. so let's have a look at how you can do this so you want to kick things off in a still air box if you don't have a laminar flow hood still air box will cost you about 20 quid off of amazon and it stops the air moving and any little nasty bits going around uh, and contaminating your petri dish you do not want nasties in there uh, so cleanliness is godliness and grow a mean keep it clean is what we always say now this next bit's really gonna confuse you. What you need to do is get your syringe and put your needle on it, quite simple. Doesn't matter if it's a liquid culture or a spore culture, make sure you give that bad boy a good shake and mix it all up, and then simply drop a couple of droplets onto your agar plate, and that is it. That is how you take a culture from your syringe uh, and let it grow out and see if it's gonna be nasty or whether it's gonna be good. Now, after a few days or a couple of weeks even, um, if it's gone well, it'll look like this. Lovely, fluffy, tasty, clean mycelium. And if it's gone bad, it will look like this. Mmm, not so tasty, not so yummy, bad mycelium.